morning guys I'm in my dad's big Ford Transit here uh, things are pretty slow back home the couple little calls we do have my technician can catch them but that's all we had today my dad is uh, not feeling well and uh, needed me to come run a few calls for him today and after everything he's done for me of course I said yes so I'm in his big tra his big Ford Transit here and uh, we're gonna go catch a couple calls on some new systems that uh, he's got some guys that, that that do work with him but they're they're only installers they're not service techs they're not troubleshooters uh, they got one air new system they put in the heat strips are not coming on and then they got a package unit that they put in and the heat strips are not coming on and then they got another one they need me to go do it's a heat pump the defrost board is not is not allowing the condenser fan motor to come on you know just in regular when it's running regular now if they hook it to the contactor the fan motor runs but when it's on the board the relay on the board won't it's not letting the the fan motor run so we're gonna see if we can get some film on some of this okay we have a brand new ICP package unit that's not heating so we're gonna jump jump the functions out here it's electric heat you can see there's no reversing valve nowhere to make sure we're getting power to it. Okay, the blower motor just came on. We have no heat kit. One amp, 1 1.6 amps. But it looks like there's little delay boards on here. They got the purple hooked up. There's the whole problem right there. No high voltage connected to the... <laughs> There's no way the heat strips are ever going to work. Okay, guys, so what I'm doing is I'm hooking up the heat kit here because my dad's guys did not. All they did was hook up the air conditioning. There's not two separate lines for the heat and the ac which there needs to be and that's what we're gonna well not me that's what my dad and him are gonna hire an electrician to come do 
but I'm just doing this temporarily to get the people some heat because it's cold. shit call anyway. So these are some wires. This looks like a number a number 10. But again, this is temporary because these people are cold. All you damn super techs out there, I don't want to hear y'all's mouth. Let me say it one more time. This is temporary for a day or two at most. Just to get these people some heat. Because they're freezing. doesn't want to bite, bite for me. Well, I just can't get her to bite. That one definitely took. That compressor wire is about the same wire as these, but again, it may not be big enough to handle the heat strip. So, my dad's already calling, getting a call in to his electrician buddy to come run another line, its own line for the heat. And like he said, if his guys would have just told him that, they'd have did it at install.
Oh yeah, there we go. Now I got her to bite. We'll put some zip ties on there. Just to help it out. All right, I'm gonna go turn the breaker back on, check power, and take an amp draw. I'm gonna put this cover. I'm gonna put this damn cover back on. I didn't need to take it off in the first place. Turn the breaker back on. Fucking dumbasses. My dad doesn't have these guys working for him anymore, by the way. Alright, so I've turned the breaker back on. Thank God they don't work for my dad no more. I get tired of coming over here and going behind them. Not really, I don't mind helping my dad. There it is, 240 something volts. Now we're gonna jump out R and W. And we're gonna go here. Let's see, let's try to go here. Hello. Yeah. All right. Okay. No, it's it's not a it's not a rush, man. We're we're dead slow right now anyway. Okay, that's it. Yeah, that'll be fine. Just let just let me know. All right, all right, bye. That damn heater still hadn't come on. No, I got it jumped out. What is this? I see. Let's, uh, this is a common. <coughs> I didn't hook that up either. The heater needs a common. All right, so the heater needs a common, obviously. They didn't hook that up either. Back to red. Look at that. We already got heat kit. There's 10KW. I didn't notice that, but the heat kit definitely needed a common. And we've got... 45 amps and I hear the blower motor running All 
I can smell them. PAJ43, that's 14 sear, 300, zero, zero, that's a two and a half ton, 14 sear package unit. Take some pictures of this for my dad so I can show him what I did. All right, guys, this one's fixed. I'm going to leave that cover right there down in the bottom. Wire's not hot. I mean, it's warm, which that's normal. But that'll get them by for a couple days until the electrician can get here to run us. The electrician is going to run a separate line. See, there's just one big line. Okay, we lost our heat kit by pulling that jumper off. The heat kit's gone. So if we go here, all we have is the blower motor running. 2.1 amps on the blower motor. Ask her where the thermostat's at. Put it on heat, turn it up. I'm sending my wife in the house to go do the functions at the thermostat. I got my phone. Before I put my meter up, I'm gonna make sure. that we added <sighs> yep it's coming on hey we're good we're good we're good Yep, ask her. Yep, tell her to set it wherever she wants. Yeah, everything's working. All right, bye. All right, she's going to let the customer know. She can set the thermostat wherever she wants. And she's got heat now. Whoa. What the hell was that? We lost our amp draw. They must have did something with the thermostat. Hey, did y'all accidentally put that thing on cool for a second? Oh, she don't want no heat on? Oh, okay. All right, bye. Okay, so the customer accidentally put the thermostat on cool for a split second. That's why we heard the compressor come on. And my wife said she does not want any heat on. Oh, she said they use it at night. They said it's not cold enough in there for the heat right now, but they did want it fixed today. Okay, I don't care, whatever. It's fixed. Until the electrician gets here, they can have heat that night. All right, guys, that'll probably do it for this one. All I got to do is put the cover back on and put the screws in that back cover. Hope y'all enjoy the video. Thank y'all for watching. And we'll see y'all on the next one.